AAA games often come with high expectations, but not all of them hit the mark. Thankfully, these indie games fill the gaps, offering unique experiences. In this video, we'll showcase 10 must-play indie games released this year that are sure to captivate and provide the satisfaction that some AAA games may have missed. Without further ado, let's get started. Let's start off this list with Hellskate, a skateboarding action roguelite developed and published by Phantom Coast. The gameplay is simple, reminiscent of typical roguelikes. You progress through rooms, engaging in hacking, slashing, and of course, skating. The overall loop is enjoyable, making the game quite fun to play. The level design stands out with its uniqueness and lack of repetitiveness, offering a diverse and entertaining experience. The art is meticulously crafted with distinct environments and appealing stylization. Characters and enemies are well designed and complement the gameplay effectively. Despite being in early access, there's already potential for significant improvements upon its official launch. Up next is Ultros, a psychedelic metroidvania where you awaken stranded on the sarcophagus, a cosmic womb containing an ancient demonic entity. Trapped in an eternal loop of a black hole, you embark on a journey to explore the sarcophagus and unravel its mysteries. The game offers an excellent experience with every moment spent immersed in what feels like a grand masterpiece. The storytelling, music, art, design, and exploration all contribute to its allure, despite the occasional frustration stemming from its puzzle mechanics. Nevertheless, Ultras remains a must-play for Metroidvania enthusiasts and anyone seeking captivating experiences every step of the way. Next on the list is Withering Rooms, a tough 2.5D horror RPG set in a procedurally generated Victorian mansion that changes every night. You'll explore Mostyn House to gather the right items for your build and confront a large cast of overgrown undead, devious witches, and more. The game offers a compelling horror RPG experience where you continually feel like a vulnerable girl trying to escape a dreadful dream. However, the tools at your disposal provide courage and enable you to combat the undead. Creating strategies is genuinely rewarding and adds diversity to the combat making death painful forces you to learn from your mistakes and stay attentive. While the story could be stronger and some aspects lack clear explanations, Withering Rooms is an indie horror challenge you won't want to overlook. Up next is Lil Guardsman, an indie gem blending humor, strategy, and point-and-click elements, telling the compelling story of a girl guarding her town. Amidst the wave of big releases in early 2024, Lil Guardsman stands out as a refreshing palate cleanser. Its heartwarming and genuinely funny narrative, along with its charming cast of characters, make multiple playthroughs a delight rather than a chore. The gameplay offers decision-making, gadgets, and a time control feature, ensuring replayability and a diverse character roster. Set in a visually stunning world, reminiscent of Disney's Gravity Rush, it shines especially on portable platforms like the Steam Deck, striking the perfect balance between cozy and comedic. Every minute of this game was a joy, and I highly recommend it for anyone in need of a smile. Next on the agenda is Penny's Big Breakaway, a delightful indie platformer boasting a captivating central gimmick and exceptional movement options. While some may find the visuals garish and encounter intentional retro quirks, these aspects add to the game's unique charm, featuring layered yet accessible gameplay mechanics and a fully realized world. Penny's Big Breakaway emerges as a resounding success that deserves attention from anyone even remotely interested in 3D platformers. While the challenge level may reach daunting heights and the controls prioritize speed, these elements enhance the overall experience. If you're on the hunt for a fresh 3D platformer, Penny's Big Breakaway should undoubtedly be at the forefront of your list. Next up is First Cut Samurai Duel, a 2D samurai simulator offering a fantastically challenging experience that vividly portrays the brutal reality of dangerous sword duels during the Sengoku period. In this game, you engage in intense slashing, clashing, parrying, and dodging. 
witnessing limbs fly amidst the atmosphere of historical feudal Japan. With a refined and intuitive fighting system, you can skillfully block and parry your opponent's attacks. Additionally, the game allows you to customize your character's outfit, adding a touch of personalization and coolness. Another intriguing feature is the option to play with friends locally or through Steam's remote Play Together feature, enhancing the social aspect of the gameplay experience. Next on the list is Turnip Boy Robs a Bank a fun and challenging twin-stick shooter with great characters and a sense of humor. While not significantly longer than its predecessor and facing similar pacing issues towards the end, this sequel has undergone a significant overhaul for the better. Its transition from a dungeon crawler to an action roguelite with notable improvements to the combat that seamlessly integrate with the new genre. Despite the changes, it retains the charm of its predecessor with more quests to complete, jokes to enjoy, and secrets to uncover. Turnip Boy Robs, a bank proves that there's always space for Turnip Boy in our gaming lives, even if he's caused a bit more chaos since we last encountered him. After the chaos brought by Turnip Boy, we're moving to Islands of Insight, an ever-evolving puzzle utopia. With puzzles that refresh over time, each visit to the islands promises new discoveries, keeping players engaged and eager to uncover the mysteries ahead. The combination of exploration, puzzle solving, and outstanding customization makes Islands of Insight a must-play for those seeking a harmonious blend of relaxation and mental stimulation. Assume the role of a seeker and let your curiosity lead you through this captivating world. Islands of Insight stands out as one of the most ambitious puzzle games, boasting a vast open world and progression hooks that elevate it to essential status. The next game on the list is Oblivion Override, an intense, hardcore action side-scroller where you navigate as a ninja killer bot through dynamic wastelands boasting over 26 specialized weapons. Recently emerging from Early Access, Oblivion Override seamlessly blends robots, action, and speed into an excellent roguelike experience. Set in a post-apocalyptic wasteland under the iron grip of AI, humanity's remnants are ensnared in the digital shackles of the Oblivion Code, where you must dodge, clash, and dominate. With a plethora of promising features, I wholeheartedly believe that Oblivion Override by Humble Mill is a must-have in your gaming library. To wrap up our indie game list, we have Anomaly Agent, a cyberpunk action-adventure offering fluid combat, a time-bending narrative, quirky characters, and an infectious synthwave soundtrack. The combat system is intricate, providing exhilarating engagements where surviving a major fight with just a sliver of health feels immensely satisfying. The presentation is top-notch, with the music deserving special mention for its contribution to the atmosphere. Despite its familiar narrative beats, the story remains engaging throughout. While some players may find certain missions, like the one involving kicking someone around, irritating, and the platforming sections may pose challenges, the game's inventiveness and inherent coolness shine through. Anomaly Agent strikes a balance, catering to newcomers while offering plenty of challenges for hardcore fans alike. And there you have it, folks. Which of these indie games are you most excited to try out? Let us know in the comments. And if you want to stay updated on the latest gaming content, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Until next time, happy gaming!